Hello, hello, I am Darkness, and welcome to Alien Isolation. I am getting to this one because I did a poll on Twitter, and I wanted to know if I should go for this, or Until Dawn, or two others, Franbo, and Among the Sleep. And if uh, you wanted to see one of those three be played before this one, you should have voted on Twitter, because I'm doing Alien Isolation, and I am fine with that, because all four of those really do, I have a hankering for them. I've already played Outlast. This game's gonna have to earn my special mood lighting like Outlast did if it's, uh, if it turns out well enough, but this is Alien Isolation. Now, uh, from what I know about this game, which is very little, and I kept that on purpose, we are about to, um, we... Do you really want to start a new campaign? I might have started this up once to see if what was going on, and I don't think I did win anywhere with it. Um, if you want to know um, a little bit about this like I do, the very little bit I do, this is set uh, with the main character as Ellen Ripley's daughter. And I can't remember the the girl that's the main uh, protagonist in this game. But El Ellen Ripley uh, is played by Sigourney Reaver in the original Alien. Uh, the woman who's a badass and kicks is just not the damsel in distress at all. Just like she kicks so much ass in that movie. And I'm excited about this game because all I've heard from it really is that they kind of went from the ground up to make sure that it kind of fit that retro type a uh, futuristic look where it was kind of the 70s and 80s version of what they thought the future would look like. So I know that I'm really going to love the design and the way this game is made. Now it's just about if it can immerse me. That's all it's got. So let's see. I think there might be a cutscene coming up now. So The opening credits, at least. I didn't, I didn't screen this to see exactly how far along we've got to go, uh, but... No, knowing his final report of the commercial starship Nostromo. Third officer reporting. The other members of the crew Kane, Lambert, Parker, Brett, Ash, and Captain Dallas are dead. Is this the log at the end of the first movie? Cargo and ship destroyed. I should reach the frontier in about six weeks. With a little luck, the network will pick me up. That is Sigour Sigourney Re Weaver. This is Ripley. Last survivor of the Nostromo. Signing off. That's pretty awesome. That is awesome that Scorny Re Weaver came back and did voices for this voice work. Already liking. So Ellen, uh, what? oh god, I don't remember the daughter's name. She makes, I can't remember her daughter's name. Damn it. It's probably going to tell me in a second, so I should just wait. Ripley? I'm Samuels. I work for the company. It's about your mother. We think we may have found her, Amanda. Amanda Ripley. There we go. A commercial vessel, the Anisadora, has recovered what we believe to be the flight recorder unit of the Nostromo. Where? Zeta Reticula. What did it tell you? We don't know. The unit wow. was taken to Sevastopol Station. It's proprietorial material, so the company wants it to be collected as soon as possible. Sevastopol's a supply depot in the region. It's a, a permanent freeport. I know facility. what it is. They didn't take a few cues from Sigourney Weaver's Transit face for arranged. Amanda. There's a courier ship called the Torrens heading out that way in two days. We're going to travel out. We? Oui. Me and another exec. And you, if you're willing. Look, Ripley, when this job came across my desk, I read the case history. Oh, case history. Now she has to think. I know why you're working in the region where she went missing. 
You're still looking, aren't you? Damn I've been right. here to offer you a place on the Torrance if you want to come along. Maybe there'll be some closure for you. I see her pores. That's pretty awesome. I have to look at pores all the time being a photographer and editing faces and everything. I have to like make pores smaller. That is so cool that it's just like, it's that. Let's see what the gameplay graphics are though. I think this is first person. I'm almost positive this is first person. Yep, that finished that positivity. Oh, I don't enjoy pants. That's what I just learned from that. Use LS to walk. Use LSD to trip. Ha <laughs> ha! See what I did there? Okay. Uh, sign in. Yeah, let's sign in. Let's, let's crank this a little. Welcome, Amanda Ripley. Explore the torrents. Oh, that stops me dead in my tracks to do something. I'm trying to... What's my run button? I, I know there's got to be a get out of dodge button. Oh, I got to click the right stick to uh, to be able to do that. Okay, fine. I'm good. And just seeing how these controls work. Awesome. Great. Love it. Uh, we'll manually save your progress. They will warn you if enemies are approaching or nearby. I don't know. It said something. That is... <laughs> that is so weird. Old new tech where they thought we'd still have corded phones up into a wall that looks like a fucking payphone. That... That is awesome. That is awesome. And a TV monitor that has uh, an antenna out the back of it. Ah, oh, Yes, old new tech is awesome. Use. Is this a shower? Okay, it didn't tell me to shower, but I just showered. So, uh, there are my feet getting wet. I'm going to use it again. I, I think I'm finished with that. Should I... Oh, it's out of order. Oh, caution, it's also wet. What should... Wh where do I get dressed? This shouldn't be... There we go. Of course, kids, we can't see this. This is... Objective, get dressed. I am wearing shoes. Look at that. Uh, uh, if I walk really slow, do I just... Uh, yep, I just put a leg out there. Knee, knee, knee. Okay, I'm fine. I'm, I'm cool. Whatever. Okay. What is the run button? Please tell me the run button. I know I'll be needing to use that button a lot. A lot. You gotta tell me what the run button is. Come on. Okay. Do I do I get in a suit? What do I do? I already forgot my objective. I'm still I'm just wandering around right now. Hope you guys don't mind. I'm just gonna commandeer some clothes and maybe some other stuff. Cause I don't give two shits about your personal shits. Yeah. Okay. Where am I going? Oh, there's another person. Hey, other person. You look. Taylor. Good morning. You look like fodder. Yeah, it's certainly not good. I very much doubt it's morning either. Wow. Sorry. I feel like death. I don't know how you people put up with hypersleep regularly. You get used to it. I don't do long haul very often. Most legal execs don't travel further than the coffee machine. I'm surprised Raylan Yutani felt the need to send legal at all. The loss of the Nostromo and its cargo hmm. cost the company a lot of money. It's important we find out what happened. If I can close the case with a conclusive accident report, it'll look great with my security. She has said everything needed to die. I'm sorry. That was insensitive. Realize your mother has been missing for 15 years and, and you. It's okay. We'll both get what we want, right? Uh, have you seen Samuels? You're gonna die. He's probably been up for hours. I'll catch up with him. All right. Speak to Taylor. What's my, what's my next objective? I'm gonna access this terminal. Because, oh my god, is this old school type thing. Uh, Nostromo incident, Wayland, Utani file. Hey Taylor, I got your ca uh, case request. It t take a while to dig out of the file, blah, blah, blah. I'm a bit fuzzy on the details. Uh, Nostromo went missing. No trace was found of its cargo or crew. Um, 
Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Lost a lot of money. Cool. Um, you know what? Don't care. Not right now. I'm sure it shed some light on story, but I think I just got the gist of it. I am simply trying to figure out... Oh. Yeah, I'm gonna... I'm gonna take some items. Um... Nope, I'm not gonna go that way. Make sure I can't go that way. Yeah, the door is locked. It says red. And red is dead. Or locked. Red dead. Redemption? God, that is an ending that was spoiled for me. I probably would want to play Red Dead Redemption if I hadn't had the ending spoiled for me. I won't spoil it for anyone else. Um, but I've got to go long enough for with forgetting what happened for me to actually, I think, really appreciate the game again. So, with that said, let me let me look around. There you are. Hey, hey, dude. Ah, oh, Ripley. Ah, oh. Samuels. Did you wake up early? Well, I don't really need as much sleep as the rest of you. I was just um, inspecting the torrent. He is not completely human. A well-maintained ship. I realize it's a very similar model to the Nostromo. Yes, M-class. A later pattern, but close in spec. I've worked engineering jobs on ships like this. Of course. Is Taylor up yet? Yep. She's not a seasoned traveler. Hypersleep may have been punishing. Oh, what are you guys we called? Talked. She seems nervous. Oh, what are you guys called? I hadn't noticed. Oh. She's a skilled executive, though. Should help us with any legal issues we might encounter. You're not. You're not human. You're not human. I can already tell. What? What? What the fuck are you called? All personnel to the bridge, approaching Sebastopol Station. Ah, uh, he's like we're up. He doesn't require as much sleep because he's one of those things that bleed white. Remember the end of Alien, where the the other guy that was like that was ripped in half, and still crawled and helped her out Ripley out remember no I'm talking about do we have to go on an alien marathon everyone stop watching this and go watch the original alien I'm waiting we're just gonna be walking so you got time I'm just gonna be on his ass walking on over here on his ass oh everyone is at the bridge Hey. Hope you all had a restful journey. Nope. The Torrens is in very good order for an old M-Class captain. She was a wreck when I bought her. Took a few years and a lot of contracts to refit. She pays for herself now. Yay. You said we're approaching Sevastopol Station. Are we docking? I believe your contact is Marshal Waits, is that right? Does he wait for I'll us? I'll hail Sevastopol and arrange boarding with him. Good. Let's get this done. Don't worry, Miss Taylor. Routine. In and out. Connor, how we doing? SMG loaded and calibrated. Approach vector locked. Thank you, Prep comm so I can say hello. Channel open, Captain. Does everyone have their briefing documents? You can watch the approach on the monitors. Briefing documents? Are they here? Are they here? Collect briefing file. Achievement unlocked. Un awake, I'm awake. Oh, cutscene! Can we see it? Switch to monitors. Sevastopol Station. That's so cool. Is that damage? It looks like damage. Punch up 74, tight angle. Looks like the dry dock bay is screwed. I can't bring the Torrens into that. This is the commercial vessel Torrens out of St. Clair, registration number MSV7760, calling Sebastopol Traffic Control. We're carrying three passengers on a whale and Yutani Bond. You're holding the Nostromo flight recorder unit. We request immediate permission to transfer the passengers portside over. They are all dead. Hello, Marshal? Marshal, this is the Torrin. Say again. You said you're fucked. Isn't this how kind of like uh, Dead Space started off when it was like, uh, we're getting mixed signals. The station's comm seem pretty screwed They sound up, fucked, but so uh, we should go in. A suit with a radio booster. I can only keep the Torrens in transit for 24 hours. You'll have heard from us by then. Safe trip. St 
stand by. My contract doesn't cover bloody spacewalks. Yeah, it's you're gonna die option. anyway. And it's perfectly safe if you do what I tell you. No, it's not. It's not gonna be safe. This is not called alien for a reason. Alien isolation. As in isolated from both of you. You're both gonna die. Fuck. Hating this. Just shout on me, Taylor. You too, Samuels. Affirmative. He said affirmative. He's what what are they called? They're like cyborgs. They're they're kind of bio uh, machine things. Oh, come on. What the f What are they called? What the fuck happened here? My god, Ripley. You're doing good, Taylor. You're doing good, Taylor. Oh Keep fuck. Moving. They couldn't have died that fast. Okay. Oh, okay, they couldn't have died that fast. They're alive. They're totally alive. I mean, they're gonna be dead, but they couldn't have died yet. I am being optimistic to say they're still alive, but they're totally gonna be dead. That is optimism, okay? That is not me being a pessimist saying that they're gonna die at the end. The game's called Alien Isolation. As in, this was an isolated incident that they brought back up, and then he, she's gonna have to go through what her mom went through, which was everyone fucking dies! That's just what happens. That's what happens in this game. I know it's what happens. I don't have to get, like, spoiler alert, everyone dies. Probably except for Amanda, because she is the daughter of Sigourney Weaver, who we will refer to from now on as Ellen Rip Ripley. The badass woman from Alien who survived. She survived. Her daughter has to survive. Samuels is... God, what? Can I look it up fast enough on my phone? Oh, it's midnight. Oh, I've already been recording for 19 minutes. Doesn't feel that long. Um, um, alien. Uh, okay. Movie. Alien movie. Let's see if I can get to it fast enough. Uh, 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 I'm not gonna get to it fast enough, am I? Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I'm totally watching this, but come on. <laughs> Oh, I'm fucked. I've got to really, like, I gotta pay attention now. Oh, no, wait a sec. Hold on. I know I'm fucked, but I just got the, the whole, I just got the whole cast up. Um, uh, 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 the engineer, uh, I don't like sci fi, blah, blah, blah. Uh, came the executive officer. Um, okay. Ash. There we go. Uh, revealed to be an android. Yes. I thought they called him something else other than android, but android is... I thought I thought they were kind of like, had a human side to them and whatnot. Okay. Changing into something else, apparently. Because, because, remember, when you're in a spaceship that's damaged, you should take off the spacesuit. Because that, that is just smart thinking right there, so... Don't wanna, don't wanna make you guys think critically or anything. Teach me the the run button. Why, why is there this? One? Oh, I can lean. Oh, that's what that button does. It's gonna warn me if enemies are nearby. Okay, let's save it again. Fine. Cool. Take my stick out of there. Put my stick in. Take my stick out. All right. So I guess this really is a creep along game. Uh, let's go down this one. I have a flashlight. Oh, I have a run. All right, depressing the pad finally gives me a run. Okay. Whoa! 
Hey, fire. Um, cool. I guess I'm not going that way. How about this way? What's going on over here? From whence I came. Uh, there's no other way to go, is there? I got out of the suit. I came in here. Went through here. Went to the left first. The right all loops around. Cool. So, what door did I miss? Already missed a door. I am that good that I can already miss a door or something. Oh, I missed this thing. Climb. I will climb through it. Yes, indeed you do. Oh, nice and claustrophobic. I like this already. I do. This already feels like um, a, a, a retro-futuristic um, dead space type of feel to it. Which, if it's like Dead Space, I'm gonna have limited weapons, scream my ass off as something comes after me, and then run like a little bitch until I get to the end of the game. Because that is what ended up happening in Dead Space. The first Dead Space got it right uh, when you play it on hard. You can't, you can't play it on normal, you gotta play that shit on hard. Okay. Uh. Sevastolink. Folder corrupted, shared decommissioning. So boys and girls, you've probably heard the whispers about Sevastopol by now, and I can confirm it's official. Sevastopol is being decommissioned. I will go over each of you. It means regards. I shouldn't point out that it does not mean lucky dip. Everything here has to be accounted for, and I'll personally escort anyone found helping. Uh, cool. Uh, folder corrupted. Cool. All right. So this was going to be a decommissioned ship. Yeah. That's as good as somebody saying, yeah, it was. Uh, this is my last thing, and I... My last time before retirement, I was just, and I have three, and afterwards, after we're finished with this, we should go on a vacation. Like, that's, that's the same as saying, oh, shit. Oh, but there's something on the other side that I wanted. Oh, damn it. And I lost some health, too. That wasn't my choice. Unless there's a jump button. Then, then it's on me. All right, I see a flare. God damn. Okay, how, how do I... This will help. Yeah. Hold B to open the radial inventory and use a left stick. Oh, even that is old school awesome. Should I have not used it yet? So if I just want to place it down, I do that. Huh. Okay. It's really bright. So... Maybe I don't want it, like, on top of me. Oh! That's what I was trying to read. Always no working Joe? Someone new. All right, let's pick this up. Pick this up. Pick this up. Pick that. Once I place it, I can't get it again. Again. Give Give the fucker to me. Let me Let me get Get this son of a son of a bitch. Live and learn. Live and or learn. All right, let's uh let's get under this thing. Glad I used up that flare because I I am a pro. That's what I am. This looks uh, searchable. Yep. Take all. Indeed. I collected a sensor. All right. You know, I, I'm hoping the game kind of stays with this feel. I like I like the idea of having to explore and not knowing exactly what the fuck is happening. I think too many horror games now immediately put you into such a tight. Like I know I'm going in a linear plot right now. But I know, also know that a lot of games so quickly, like, give you the objective and how to do it and where to go that it, like, becomes monotonous really fast. And it just feels like you're going from one point to the other waiting for the next cutscene. And I don't want to do that. And what is that bright light? And I'm going toward it. Toward. Collect a bonding, bonding agent. Do I hear a boombox? Wow! I still got one of these to take to me to the beach to pr in, uh, impress all the ladies. Yeah, impress all the ladies. 
This is Sweet Jams by Darkness Jackson. To impress all the ladies. Hello? Flipping that cassette tape. Anyone here? Hello, Billy? Anyone? Seems dangerous. I'm gonna go take a shower now alone. Alright, took a shower. I'm good. Alright. Can't access that terminal. Doesn't look like there's anything there. Lots of happy posters. Always means bad. Okay, update my map. Cool. And use that to get into the map. Okay, that's where I am. There's the passenger lounge. There's the emergency airlock where I saved it. There's uh um blocked doors. When the when the what's the legend? Where's my John Legend? Yeah, it means locked. Cool. Alright, I'm going the correct direction. Uh tomorrow to get no to yeah, tomorrow no together I can't read that. I'm illiterate. I can't read stuff. Use this. Yes. Oh, that was so hard. Use it again. Oh, that was so hard. Use it again. Oh. All right. What does that mean? I got everything reworking. Cool. Yes, access terminal. Sevasta Link. Engage. Moved our stash. Langley, if you're looking for our stash, I've moved it. You left it right on the open where everyone could have taken it. Jesus! Do you know what I had to do to get it? I've hidden it in one of the storerooms. You should be able to find it. The code is 0340. Don't worry, no one goes to the ter terminal anymore after what happened. Also, we're out of meds and low on water, so if you're going to need some water, it's your turn. Maybe I'll teach you to take care of your stuff in the future. And this is where I take a picture of the code, just in case. Yep, because I don't like... Uh, sadly, it's coming to an end. Okay, cool. Harris, Turner, get back here now. We have a track somewhere in engineering. Lock the terminal down, kill the power, and don't forget your reports. Make them thorough. We're gonna need our paperwork to be bulletproof when this shit's over. Wait's up. Uh, why does our shit need to be, uh, bulletproof? Because you know that some stuff has gone down? Would you like to fill me in on any of it? Would you like to fill anyone that is not Doesn't in anything here work? Ah, oh, find a way to store the power to the shutter. Okay. Well, you know what? It's interesting enough that I'm definitely coming back to it. I know it's building up because the first Alien movie had to build up to it. Um, so, um, thank you so much for watching. I know the action is coming. So hold on, hold on a second. I'm still trying to judge whether these should be hour long or not. But the next one at least will be 30 minutes. So. Uh, thank you for watching. Come back. I know the it, just watch the original Alien. You'll realize why it's considered one of the top ten movies ever made of all time type thing. So uh, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you coming by. Talk to me. Subscribe. Like it if you want to see more of this. Um, comment to talk to me. Did I say talk to me? And um, yeah, all that good stuff. And um, I'm gonna sign off for right now. And I hope to see you again really, really soon. Bye! I don't like the fact that you're twitching. Please stop twitching, please. Just, I'm gonna go by and... Ah! Shit! Oh god!